Ms. Mulungi Faith, a volunteer of Uganda Red Cross Society, Mukono Branch. Many youth got involved in agriculture since it is, it is the best business to do in Uganda, but due to the lockdown district by district, many of them cannot send their goods to other districts because they even don't have personal vehicles to help them do that, and the traders also can't move. Due to this, many of them cannot sell their goods and the stock they are having in their homes, let me say like Matoke, they've been shown that the prices have really dropped and the youth can't get the amount they invested in. Can you believe that even a bunch of Matoke here in Uganda in some districts is as 500? That, that means that all the farmers are not gaining what they really wanted and what they expected. And this is due to the fact that there, is, there are even no companies in Uganda that deal with, with transporting goods of agriculture from place to place, there, there are no licensed companies to do that. The solution to this problem, I think, it should be that in Uganda they, sh they should invest in people, those who are willing to start up companies that deal with agriculture transportation, and they should have licenses, those companies should receive licenses so that, goods in, so that goods in situations like this can be transported from place to place. Because the yields are there, the food is there, but each district is being stuck with the food it grows. And, it, and it's actually get, not gaining the thing, the farmers are not gaining the thing they expect.